I've come to the Innovation Summit because I really feel that WA is a complete innovation environment about to be discovered and I think it's important that we bring together as many sectors and as many industry participants, as many government regulators, the whole ecosystem so that we can have a real and rich conversation on how we leverage WA as an innovation hub. Collaboration is, is essential. What we tend to do is innovate in a vacuum, in a bubble, and we don't solve real problems necessarily. And I think there's a mindset, you know, the, the one parable mindset that it's going to be a killer app or I'm, I'm, I'm just going to go create something amazing, a new invention. It isn't that at all. Fa innovation is a fabric. It's an ability to work together, continuously improve, solve deep problems that are meaningful to people and that's the human element so unless we get together as a group as a community as an ecosystem and solve real life real industry problems then we will create standalone outcomes that, that may or may not succeed and could be marvellous but they won't shift the dial in terms of creating a new platform for WA and for Australia I believe. You know the beauty of bringing such a disparate, and I, I don't mean disparate in a, in a negative sense, but a completely diverse group together. Fabulous that there are so many women at this. This is just so exciting. But the other part is we've got angel investors here. We've got VCs, venture capitalists. We've got small startups. We've got startup platforms. We've got successful Indonesian, Asian outfits that are Australian sitting in Southeast Asia, that we really are melding that advantage of common time zones. So as, as technology shrinks distances, our advantage now is how do we leverage a time zone so we can solve problems real time. Every time we get together as a broader group, we'll drive innovation forward. And the word, I, I, it was interesting, I saw a tweet that said, let's turn a talk fest into an action fest, and that's that's really important. But if, if one person, each person that sits here today does something a little bit differently, engages differently, looks to engage with somebody that they traditionally wouldn't have engaged with, then that's the power of the gathering, that's the power of the group, that's the power of the community.